Hi, I'm Dr. Elsie Cook and I welcome you to my channel on Mission with Elsie. It's been a while since I uploaded a devotional on this channel, but this morning while listening to my devotional, this verse jumped out at me. It's in Job 13, 15. It reads, Though he slay me, I will hope in him. Nevertheless, I will argue my ways before him. Job was a righteous man, but even as a righteous man, he went through a lot of trials and adversity and difficulties. And yet, through those times, through those difficult times, when he could have easily cursed God, he chose to do two things according to this verse. First, he hoped in God. And second, he said, he argued his ways before God. Perhaps you're going through a lot of difficulties and challenges right now, a lot of problems. But I encourage you, just like Job, learn to hope in God and learn to argue your ways before Him. To argue your ways before Him means to confide in Him, means to tell Him everything that you are feeling, your sense of betrayal, your sense of unfairness, reason, lay it all before God. Because God is always up to the challenge of addressing whatever it is that concerns you. Going back to Job, towards the end, because he learned to trust God, and because he learned to commune with God, even in the most difficult time, even at a time when his children has died, his wife left him, his friends betrayed him, and he was already sick, he was covered in boils. Even in the time, he trusted and hoped in God and continued to converse with God. In the end, God rewarded Job's faithfulness. Job prayed for his friends who betrayed him. And the Bible says that after he prayed for his friends, the Lord restored all his fortunes. In fact, the Bible says that the Lord gave him twice as much as before. Job 42 verse 12 says, So the Lord blessed Job in the second half of his life, even more than the beginning. So maybe life is hard for you at this time. Maybe you are being tested. But just like Job, don't lose hope. Come to the Lord. Bring all your petitions to him, for he is faithful to listen to all your cries and to answer your prayers. God bless you. Thank you very much for watching this.